concept of the bursary and why I think it's so important. So the bursaries are ways to actually support people who don't have the ready financial means to come to program. And I think it's a reasonable thing and good thing to be doing in general. But more importantly to me is that allowing people from all walks of life to participate in programs enriches not only that individual's life, but also the lives of all of the people in the program itself. Because having the whole varied experience that we have as human beings enriches each and every program. I have had the beauty of seeing the joy in people's eyes. This was a surprise when I was working at the clinic doing a course that we do. This is a substance use clinic. And this woman was in the group and she said, gee, my friend went to this great program. It was called The Haven. And she was um, loving the experience of her friend and lamenting that you know, she didn't have any money and she wouldn't really be able to go, but wouldn't it be a wonderful dream? And we were chatting and I said, you know, it's not impossible. They do have a bursary program. And you should have seen the smile. <laughs> and she went to her counselor and found out more about it. And I know she's gone. And she's so grateful for that. And the beautiful part is she and her friend now can relate and connect. And they have a shared common experience. And so the benefit of that is continuing. So the amazing things that I've seen when a mid-level manager is sitting next to an out-of-work logger in the same program and discovering in each other a humanity that they did not believe was in that other individual is part of the magic that happens at Haven. And I would be actually quite sorry to see Haven restricted as far as the range of individuals that we could actually have participating in the programs due to the cost alone. I've seen how when one person comes, and these are people, some of them have been people that are street people, were street people. I've met at the clinic, they've come to the Haven, and now I'm seeing them teaching other people. They may not have money to give back to the Haven, but let me tell you, they are, they are sharing with their friends, they're talking to other family members about it. One person has actually using all that he's gained in his experiences at Haven, integrating it into his life, has actually had his dream come true, which is reconnecting with all of his siblings. And as they've had challenges, he continues to use all that he's using um, to continue to be boundaried and help support other members in the family. So it's just having this ripple effect. So I know that I routinely donate 10% of all of my income from the Haven to the bursary program just because I believe that this is such an important part of keeping the Haven and the Haven experience as rich, varied, and human as I have experienced it over the last 30 some years. I will own the, 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 the thrill or joy that comes in giving, which is actually true. Yeah. However, more than that for me is at least giving the possibility to somebody to be able to make a difference in their life that I know for me made a huge difference. So to be able to be part of that, or at least the potential of that for somebody else is one of the reasons I like to donate. It was, it was actually very easy, a relief to know the financial aid was there. Because by the time I, I, I came to the finance, I found out about the financial aid, I was very motivated to get into a program here at the Haven. Yeah, it is hard to ask for, for help. But a big part of it is looking and seeing, like I saw that I, I'm worth this. So I'm gonna try as hard as I can and um, see where it goes. So um, I was just so surprised that there actually were people that um, gave their money to people or f to people like me and helped them um, continue on their uh, search for more or less mine is self-responsibility and <laughs> awareness of things that I do and patterns and 
and it was just awesome. I just couldn't believe people would actually do that. I didn't have any idea what to expect with Come Alive, except for that it was, I had heard that it's, it can be life-changing, so I was terrified. <laughs> it's pretty overwhelming, because um, you're just hearing what life is like for many different people of all different ages. Uh, and all the people right away, I could sense that people were feeling differently, but there were also a warmth that was being given off. I take so much more responsibility, and not that I don't go back to patterns, but so much more responsibility for the way my life is and how I um, interact with people in my life. From the first day to the last day, it's like a completely different Brittany. Yeah. My life has uh, drastically changed, and that might even be an understatement. I went from this um, a lack of confidence, um, would stay in my house and not leave my house, full of anxiety. If it wasn't anxiety, it was depression. So somebody was very isolated to a person who's back out uh, building and repairing relationships. Um, I, I've received a job in my new career and I, I can't remember the last time I was this happy. I kind of realized that I do have empathy and um, can share what goes on with me and actually help support others. And that's one of the reasons why I started interning 